Hello, welcome to another set of readings from Lotus Love Tarot 555. Okay, you guys, today I'm going to do your full moon. This is a mini reading. I don't care how many times I say this. There's always someone that thinks this is a full reading. It is not a full reading. This is just to give you an idea of where you want to set your intentions, okay? Like I said, we've got the full moon coming up. So if you don't know how to set your intentions, go to our full moon playlist. And we have a video there that gives instructions on how to do that. Now, you guys, this is a very, very important full moon. This full moon will be coming in on February 9th at, I've seen two times, 2.33 a.m. and 2.34 a.m. So we know it's somewhere between there. Um, but it will be in the sign of Leo, okay? And again, this is called a super snow moon, okay? And the reason they call it a snow moon because the Native Americans say it around this time, of course, and at this point is really, you know, common sense in a lot of places. This is the time we get a lot of snowfall, okay? And so the Native Americans named it the snow moon. Now, this is a super moon because it's going to be able to sing, um, it's going to appear as, a, as if it's very, very close to Earth, okay? Um, so let's just talk about what's going to happen right now by it being in the sign of Leos. Now, Leos, they're very passionate, very playful, very, they can be theatrical sometimes. But Leos, they are scene stillers, okay? The spotlight just follows them. And, you know, and this is not the best time to kind of have like deep dialogue about any trouble spots that may be in your relationship. This is not a time to talk about that. See, um, uh, Leos, they're brave. They they are courageous. So take this time to do something courageous. You know, have fun with this full moon. This is a great time to have some champagne by the moonlight. Or this is a great time to, you know, begin planning a very memorial Valentine's Day. But just know that let this moon work for you and not against you, okay? Again, this is not a time to have really, really serious conversations. Just, as they say, just go with the flow with this full moon. Now, Thank you so much for those who continue to watch our channel. You guys, once again, if you want to get right to your reading, just fast forward this, but I always need to greet those who may be joining us for the first time. So I thank you for that, okay? Do know I read all your comments and I thank you for all of the positivity that you keep bringing to our channel. Now, just a little bit about this reading. You can apply this to your sun, your moon, your rising, and for some, even your Venus sign. Do remember that the messages may flip-flop, okay? So if it doesn't relate to you, it could relate to your partner and hello to our cross watchers okay um again we have this time slated for the full moon energy so you'll know how to set your what what areas you need to look at to set your intentions okay you guys don't forget to subscribe to our channel like the video right ne next to the subscribe button is a little bell so hit that little bell and every time we release a reading you'll be notified and don't forget we have a patreon membership okay soon i will be doing the Mercury retrograde survival readings. If you are a member of our Patreon, you'll get an opportunity to get those readings. Okay, this is a very, very important time because we right now we are in the shadow period for Mercury retrograde. And lastly, don't forget I do um, have private readings available. So if you would like a private reading, information pertaining to that can be found below. Again, thank you guys so, so much. Thank you for all of your support you continue to give to us now. On to your mini reading. Hello, my Pisces. Okay, you guys, let's get right into it. And remember, this is not a full reading now. This is just to give you an idea of where you need to set your intentions uh, for this full moon coming up, okay? All right, so let's just see where you are. Holy Spirit, Divine Creator, Universe, what messages need to go forth for the sign of Pisces? As they begin to set their intentions on the full moon occurring on February 9th, 2020. Put messages, okay. Okay. Holy Spirit, divine creator of the universe, what messages need to go forth for the sign of Pisces? As they begin to set their intentions on the full moon occurring on February 9th, 2020. What messages need to go for? All right, my Pisces. Okay, Holy Spirit, Divine Creator of the Universe, what messages need to go for? for the sign of Pisces. As they begin to set their intentions on the full moon occurring on February 9th, 
2020. Universe what messages need to go forth on the Pisces as they begin to set their intentions on the full moon occurring on February 9th, 2020. What messages need to go forth for the sign of Pisces? What messages need to go forth for the sign of Pisces as they begin to set their intentions on the full moon occurring on February 9th, 2020? What messages need to go forth? Okay. Make sure my flippers are there. All right, my Pisces, let's see. True love. This is the romance of a lifetime, okay? So this is a good space. It's true love, passion. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. For those that are single, very soon. Clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. For those that are in a relationship, this is your true love. You're very passionate about it, but there's a situation that you're dealing with right now that you're yearning for. And so Spirit says, you got to really decide what you want in this situation. Even though you all are in love and you're very passionate, but it's just a, a, something that's going on that you need to make a decision on or your partner needs to make a decision on. Remember, because the messages can flip-flop. Consult an expert. More information is needed. Contact someone with expertise in this area. So apparently, whatever this is, you need to, see, you need to talk to somebody about it. Now, this could also mean that you're with somebody that you thought was your true love, even though you're very passionate, but it's not working out. And this expert right here could be a divorce attorney. Attorney Could be going in that direction as well. Again, it's just really, really hard because these are, these are general readings. But again, if it resonates with you, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. So I feel like this could go in two different directions. This is your true love, your passion about it, but there's a situation that's going on that you need to really decide about that you may need to talk to somebody about, okay? If you're single, this true love could be coming in for you. You're very passionate about it, and it's going to happen, but you got to decide, really, is this really what you want? Is this person really what you want? And consulting an expert, you may need to talk to somebody, okay, just to talk you through this. This could be a minister. This could be a counselor. This could be a friend. Okay, that kind of experience which you're trying, you're going through now. Uh, but the situation is already resolved. Wow. <laughs> situation is already resolved. But you need to express your individuality. Allow your, uh, what does that say? You allow your true self to shine because you're awesome. I don't have my glasses on, you guys. But express your individuality, but allow your true self to shine. Okay. And yes, okay, so once again, for some of you, it's going to resonate different ways because it can be read different ways, but whatever your in spirit is confirming, this is where you need to be. The situation is already resolved. It's going to be resolved, but you got to express your individuality. You may need to talk to somebody. And again, some of you, this, you, this, even though you thought this was your true love, you're very passionate about this person, but you got to decide if you want, if you're staying or you're going. Okay. All right, my loves, if you want to do a private reading, information pertaining to that can be found below. Until next time. Bye-bye.